Hey guys, it's Lena from the Land of Gods and we are doing the weekly reading for the sign of Capricorn. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus from the 20th to the 26th of September. Remember, these are general readings. Energies can be flipped. Time is fluid and cards can pick up sometimes energies of your loved one and not directly yours. So everything said here might not resonate with you. Take what resonates, leave the rest for others to receive. You come in here for the first time. Welcome to my channel. You are here again. Thank you so much for showing me your love. Let's start. First card. Yes. Yes. Let's see what our Moonology deck has to say. Moonology. Your hard work is paying off, my Capricorn. The answers you need are coming. Wow. Capri's. Awesome energy. The answers you need are coming. It's a yes. And your hard work is paying off. Lovely. Let's get into tarot. Past, present, future energy is what we are going to try and tap into. Clarify them and then get a final word from the universe. Past energy for my Capricorns, please. Past energy for my Capricorns. We've got the Hanged Woman and the Princess of Coins. Present energies. We have the Lovers and the Four of Swords. Healing? Healing from what? Whoa, okay. Queen of Cups. Compassion for yourself with others. Three of Coins. Celebrations. Celebrations. Nice. Please clarify the Five of Cups has come out. Five of Cups with the Hanged Woman and the Princess of Coins. Some kind of a loss you, you were grieving. You had to go within. This could have been to do with kids, princes of coins. It's a, it's a young energy. This could have been with a new venture. This could have been a message that came along to you that put you in this weird zone that put you in this grieving phase that put that forced you to go within that forced you into isolation as well the present energy Lovers and the Four of Swords. We have the world. Wonderful. A new phase in love beginning or a new phase with a loved one. Taking it to the next step after having healed from the pain. I somehow feel that this could be healing a relationship after a betrayal or healing yourself after a being betrayed by your lover bringing a cycle to an end bringing a face to an end or bringing a relationship to an end and trying to heal yourself world is also about traveling healing yourself moving in or moving out who knows the future, the Queen of Cups, we have the High Priestess. 
the bottom empress beautiful beautiful divine feminine flowing you have the queen of cups with the high priestess with patience and perseverance and going within and connecting with your divine higher self you were able to move from this isolated energy this grieving to being yourself again claiming this ace of cups being the queen with the high priestess with balance within you could reflect that balance outside with patience and perseverance you are heading towards something very very creative something beautiful something that's going to bring you a lot of joy something that is going to bring celebrations and it was hard it is not easy to be in this phase and move towards healing yourself healing needs a lot of introspection and you did that and your hard work is going to pay my capricorns yes the answers that you need for you to be able to heal and come into this power stand in this power of empress start something new something creative be compassionate towards yourself and others you are getting those answers a final message for my capricorns please we have the king of cups the queen and the king of cups a perfect couple with harmony yeah lots lots fair exchange the lot of fire and strength communications answers are coming your way for sure we have the communication card yeah being just and fair in a situation being compassionate be having that harmony having that fire and that perseverance and that strength you know to be able to stand in the to be able to stand your ground in the situation that you are to be able to heal My Capricorns, I'm sending you a lot of power. You hang in there. It's gonna happen. It's coming your way. I thank you all. It's a wrap. Namaste from the land of gods.